Hello guys, welcome back again. Oh, don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. Today, I just want to show us real quick uh, the lab that they will kill us and take for the past couple of days. Uh, basically, it's an active directory um, lab that was um, building up, building up for the past two, three days now. Just want to show you guys the progress and like to know or hear your feedback what you think about it so i already set up the uh active directory domain uh controller on this and i have multiple user set up where it is so that the active directory could have we have the users couple of users with different as and with permissions and all that roles so and also, I had that one computer, uh, Windows 10 computer, to the the main controller. So, but the fun part of it is, uh, so I installed this RAM on the server. So from there, I will be able to um, set up on Apache server. You see, it's still still running here, and also I set up like um, FTP server, so using this Brazilla from the sound power control panel. So, both are kind of um, working right now. So, and the fun part of it is uh, go to the uh, um, Brazilla, let's log in. So, we can easily edit and we'll make some configuration. I have an enabled login, it's what password that we've been set up there. Uh, I just to have some fun with it. So we can log in and we'll go sleep to the FTP server without um, uh, putting our password. And on the web server of the Apache, if we go there, we check it out. And actually, let's see what you find there. So I'm going to find your top. So the app address of the server is 6 8. So here we go there you see. So this is what you find there. You know, that says, click on the notes that says and see uh well kind of a putting notes uh on there. So this is more like a CTF like uh that you can practice on kind of live. So here you give the information that an anonymous account is active. So from there as an attacker, you can easily dictate that an anonymous uh, access is allowed on the FTP side. You log in anonymously and view all the information uh, on the system. So another thing I want to show is on the machine that I joined to the domain on the Windows 10, I also set up a variable um, web application on, on there as well and also my SQL um, database uh, is also set up there so just want to you know try to mix uh, make it fun and enjoyable if you run and map all this is world in the server you can see a lot of bots have opened and um uh, Let's wait a little bit for it to run as it's running. Let me open the Windows 10 um, web. So this is the IP 1618. So put the uh, DWA. So if you push here, I'll study what application, what application on here. Yeah, you can yeah, practice how uh, you uh, your uh web application security testing skills and all that different different um whatever ability what you to you can find this can you kind of find the push and all that so we all know about this application so i just basically hosted it on one of the on the windows uh windows 10 i joined to the dc other thing that is fun on the windows server so on the Windows server, I open port 8084 PRGT, uh, PRG, uh, T network. So it's like 
network monitoring tool. So if I go to the website, six eight dot so we have we have see we have TG network monitoring, and you know basically once you try to load it, uh, this is the username, this is the password. Uh, so it's it's a default password. Once you log in, you can easily see all the network and like all the machines, devices connected, and all that. So uh, I know there are a lot of out there regarding this uh that's attached to this uh, tool as well the this uh, this device that uh, you just try to see how you can integrate this and just set up some misconfiguration on it so that we able to do some practices and all that so uh yeah that is what I think and uh, let's check the result of them you can see for them have star results uh it's gonna follow up so this is a DC wrap for 21 open. We have DNS 53, we have 80, we have 88 cables. So we can perform some cables attack. Uh then dials one three have a SMB2, 045, open. And you know, LDAP is think LDAP is open great like yeah. The LDAP is open. So here you can perform different kind of Active directory attacks within the RAM and um, just to have some fun. And the last one I want to show is the for the Windows. We open the Windows, uh, unless you have a big lab scan on the Windows, you see on the window you have a SMTP or full of 25 as well, mail transfer, one that. So can perform the initial access and just access to the windows itself from there you can move laterally the network um, and that will be again on the DC the way I set it up I'm still trying to see what I can add to it and any suggestion from you guys is also welcome that you think I can integrate so to the environment so that is what I've been on for the past couple of days just to see how I can do this and you know make it fun and lively but yeah, that is what I wanted to show you. I can let me know your thoughts about it. And um, also, every suggestion is, you know, welcome. I'll definitely look into it and, you know, add it to the environment. So I'm looking also to add a uh, probably elastic. Uh, but yeah, but I don't know yet, but still trying to figure out what, you know, be the best to put it into the environment of art. So let me know your thoughts and I'll be looking out for your comments and your suggestion. So guys, this is what I have for you guys today. Uh, I'm looking out for your suggestion and also watch out for the next video. I appreciate you guys once again and also do enjoy the rest of your week. Bye. <music>